me is Time Lord. We're gonna watch a replay of the 1v1 Far East tournament uh, for Company Heroes. So, Time Lord, what's It's Mexico something? versus Yankee. Yeah, Mexico versus Yankee. Uh, if you don't know the mod, you should check it out. It's like the Chinese and the Japanese. Um, it's very cool, so uh, let's start it. Okay, Time Lord, you ready? Yeah. Okay, let's start ready. it. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, well, Yankee's not no, not doing so much at the start. Um, AFK. Um, I'm I'm not sure. I Max might be like Maxkov is Maxkov's running through. Oh, it. he's doing stuff. He's doing stuff. Apparently, there was some lag there at the beginning. Yeah, yeah that's probably the reason. Like we had to divide the pool in like two separate uh, regions, like the uh, Europe region and uh, in the Asia region. So um, we try to match it up a bit, so the Asian people will arrive. play versus each other, because uh, also the times will be a bit old. Looks like Max has a head start here. Yeah, I think that, so too. Like ten second lag, Max has a head start. Definitely. Oh well, uh, Yankee researched trenches in the beginning. Well, that's odd. That's peculiar. Time Lord, what do you think about that? Researching the trenches first. Well, that's something I would normally do because you want to go defensive, but. Yeah, but like at the beginning. I haven't played this uh, mod much, but trenches in this one are pretty hard to keep because all infantry have grenades from the start. Yeah, true. It's not like no, we can build well, trenches and Japanese the team might not have grenades. Yeah, I think the Japanese need to tech up first, but. Um, then again, like you, you waste 150 manpower, you get like. 500 something in the beginning, so it's quite a considerable um, amount you put in like this research, and in the you can't build any engineers extra. So very interesting, though. Very interesting. Max is pumping out infantry. He's got a foreign squad, and he's got an IJ regular. Yankee. Yeah, Yankee hasn't been very infantry heavy. He's like floating yeah, 500 yeah. manpower at the moment. This guy is wasting all his manpower. Not wasting, but using it. Yeah, guys, these are not like. Uh, these are just players from our tournament. They're like randoms all over. So, um, we're not sure what to expect from it. Oh, now he's building something. He's, he's building out. two NRA regulars. Yep. And he hasn't gone for the VP either down his side. He's only gone for mid. I think he wants to capture the territories for first. Then he's going to bunker down. Yeah, I agree. Like territories in the beginning are much more important than the VPs. Uh, in my opinion, though. So. Uh, yeah, Always depends like, on which faction you're playing, but in this game, both factions are pretty balanced, unlike Brits in the other company of heroes where they can just, you know, dig in and hold the VP yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, definitely. But here, they're going to have to get a territory, get the resources first, fight over the territory, while at the same time holding the VP. Max has gone for the second one, he's going to have the lead here. Yeah, we see it taking down already. And uh, yeah, uh, cover and um, micromanage is very important, just like in the regular company heroes. Um, I think it's slightly more punishing in this mode. Like damage from uh, infantry is increased. And yeah, it's very infantry Health based. decreased as well. Sorry. Yankee in a tough spot there, the there goes oh, the grenade, there goes the first goes grenade. grenade, let's see, oh. well only one, it could be worse, but if he doesn't get them out in time, then they might just throw a second grenade. My bets are go not gonna retreat, no, not gonna retreat, he's well, got a second see, squad Let's flanked. see if he can get a nice flank of Maxwell, uh, Yankee. 
I think you should use the grenade cover from out, the wall. Oh, oh, those three men in the building are holding up right now. Yep. Oh, that's grenade. He's got an extra. Max has got another squad from the north, but Yankee has another squad from the south. No, 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 no. Max is in retreat. Well played there by Yankee. Held out. Which did his advantage. He held but out, but like. If you look down mid, just below the mid VP, he's got grenadiers now. Max has got grenadiers. Grenade discharge the squad. Oh, yeah, I love those guys. to get back in those buildings, he's in trouble. Well, I don't, I'm not sure why he's not getting out, like, to. Um, Take advantage of the like the small victory you just achieved, and he is cut off, which is also like considerably um, from yeah. It's it was quite big push from um, Yankee, uh, or I mean Maxwell. He even managed. Yeah, to Max break. came off from all the resources. Yeah, he cut him off there. from the resources. He's cut off he has right like, now. He's um, put up a good fight. Plus ten fuel and plus ten munitions. So yeah, I think he should be start capping now with the at least one of those units in the in the building. Max has plus 48 munitions and plus 32 fuel, and he's going on 620 manpower, 30 manpower. Oh, wow. Right now, and he's got 333 income manpower, so he's doing good. Yeah, definitely. He hasn't selected a, do he hasn't selected a doctrine yet. Uh, no, same here. I don't, I'm not sure he... Uh, uh, I'm not sure... Uh, I'm not thinking uh, Yankee has selected a doctrine either. He is building his quartermaster, though, so we might be able to see some uh, mortars. Same here, Maxkov. He's getting his weapons support station up. Okay, oh, mid VP. Here we go. Oh. Ooh, missed grenades. Grenades are out. But another grenades. Oh. oh, there goes grenades. A good uh, start only from two. Max, only two. Like uh, lots of health. Yankee's and pushing back. Two men. Uh, two men. But could be worse. Yeah. Oh, there comes the grenade discharger. He's gonna have a lot of fun. Here it goes. Oh. oh my god. Almost. Just almost. Oh wow. Yeah, that's the. Oh no. Instant it. vet for the grenade charger. 16 kills. Wow. That's very punishing. Very punishing. And he still has like two engineers not doing anything. He should be using them to like cap stuff. Yeah, he should come from the north to get the munitions. Yeah, you know, like just get the cutoff point, just quickly make sure you get uh, enough resources. Because right now, not He's not even trying to connect his territory again. He's making no push down mid. Yeah, yeah I think he should be like, for his own yeah. territory. He's not pushing to for the VP. His territory again. Yeah, he's not pushing for the VP. He should get like the resources he needs. Um, first by getting the cutoff point, and then like maybe then you can go for the VP. But you should get the fuel on the side and um, the munitions. Uh, munitions are also very important. Like everything goes around with munitions. Else you can't build any MGs or mortars. And I think he's just punching up his infantry at the moment. Like let them cap quick. Don't send them in in hordes, because like the great just charger or mortars will just shred them. Oh, we see support Max armory. Max has gone southern. He's gone the southern doctrine, southern troops. The expeditionary, yeah, yeah, they're great. Yep. We, we could see like an armed He's pumped out a lot quick. of troops. He's got a lot of troops right now. He's got two IGAs. He's got his grenadier discharger. He's got another four. Oh yeah, I see the southern troops. And, oh. and he's got a southern troop out. Those models are so cool. What I think the Yankee's trying to do is, I think he's trying to save up for armor. Depending um, on which doctrine he's got. Well, he should be focusing on fuel, Mark. Like the right fuel um, is uncontested right now. Like There are two guys there uh, right now. But like before, he could have easily get someone to cap it. Um, maybe look it down. Yeah, but he did try to go for it before. He did try to go for it before. Oh, oh well, I didn't see that. I'm really curious if um, we're gonna get uh, a very early armored car from Mexico. 
He should be able to. He has enough um, map advantage. Yankees in pushing. It is Max. They're building up their forces. Oh, Max is laying mines down here, just below the middle VP. How much munitions does, does he have? Down the road. He has 74 right now, but he's got 48 income. Okay, yeah, well, then it's... Then you could invest in some mines, yeah. Here goes the HMG nest, yeah. which can easily be flanked. Well, maybe he uses it for the... Oh, we see the armored car. Uh, maybe he uses it for the um, reinforcement capabilities. Possibly. And he's trying to upgrade the house to four he, uh, he aimed it towards the hedgerow. Why did Yankee aim his MG towards the hedgerow? Uh, maybe he wants to get the MG out of it and just put another one in it. Um, maybe. Oh. But not sure. Not sure. Oh, look at this person. He put on the that right. much manpower into him. Of course, he thought of something. Max is going for the mid munitions. Oh, the southerners are in retreat. Ooh. Uh, I'm not sure how. Oh, that grenade. Ooh. I'm not sure how Yankee's gonna hell hold on to this because right now it's looking pretty grim for him. See, there's that MG now. It's faced the wrong way and. <laughs> That armored car might take it out slowly but surely. That these Killing NRA so regulars have something in store other than grenades. Uh, well, the grenades can They're do a lot of, of damage. However, yeah, stuff. if you position this MG rightly, um, he could have used the armor piercing rounds. He could have done a lot of damage. Yeah, he could have used armor piercing rounds, exactly. See, now his infantry is getting wrecked right there. Yeah, the infantry won't be able to do anything. Was, he didn't place it right. He did not place that. Oh, that negative cover though. Oh. Oh, just retreat. Got another one out. Two armored cars oh, now. Oh, well, that must be GG in there. Unless he gets some army, uh, armor real quick, but right now he has no armor um, capabilities. Not even the, like the building. He's in his base. Use his armor piercing rounds. Use them! No, he hasn't. He isn't. He, he isn't. Oh. Uh, situation looking pretty grim right now. Yankee. I mean, he can't do much damage to those M25s. But uh, well, like even like normal uh, machine guns, out. if you upgrade your infantry with like the machine gun upgrade, they can do quite a lot of damage. Yeah, the Bren. Uh, n yeah, like no, but even like normal, the Chinese Bren. Um, There's a Type 11. And oh, type he's 90. building a jeep right now from his HQ. He went um, the what's it called? The British American um, doctrine. That one. Yeah, but he's got the t Max. He has a Type 1 half track right now. And I believe he's just gonna pound Oh yeah, that it's base. the call-in, it's just the, like the, the howitzer Kingdom with bomb. it. The Type 96 howitzer. Yeah. Yeah. It's a very strong, yeah. very long range, and um, I quite like it. I think yeah, it, it has the, the longest range from the field guns. What is that Jeep gonna do? He's going for the artillery. Die, oh, GA he, he on the be. way. Oh. What is he doing with that jeep? Uh, jeeps can't capture, by the way, so... Oh, he's cool not capturing feature. anything right now. Oh. <laughs> I think Max is enjoying himself, he just left his base. <laughs> yeah, he's floating 1,000 manpower at the moment. A VP. 1,000 manpower? Yeah, 1,000, 1,100 right now. What is he doing with and that he's manpower? Just building an engineer, and uh, I'm not sure. And there goes the howitzer. We're losing a strategic sector. You know, my OCD and the cringe right now because of that MG nest. <laughs> it's 
facing the wrong way! And there you go, it's getting wrecked. Oh, he's building... Oh, he's doing death wrecks for Oh, no, MG is on the run! MG is on the run! No, you're not going anywhere, mate. I like how in this mod they allowed you to actually kill the infantry inside the MG nest, so you can actually take the MG out and use it like as a yeah, yeah, that's cool. A fortification. Best thing that what you know, the best thing you know, if it can make an addition if you, they allow you to put a motor team in there. That'd be beautiful for a motor team in the nest. Uh -huh. you know? Well, yeah. <laughs> Just put it long range. Uh, I think it like should be okay balanced, maybe. The the MG position is very sturdy though, so maybe a mortar in it would be a little too too strong. Overkill. Yeah. <laughs> if infantry gets close, they can still kill the mortar team easily for me. Yeah. You because know? grenades are always readily available. Oh, Yankee's not doing anything at the moment. Not building. Not using his callings. No, he's bringing some British armed infantry. Uh, and it's a grenade that missed. Here comes Egg. He packs his grenade and blows up half the squad. Allies are down to 300 points. 300 what's, points. what's the time for you right now? It's 16:03. Okay. Yeah. No. Oh, no. We're not, I'm not that far behind. Just a bit. Let's see if the half truck can do some damage. A lot. Yeah, oh, the howitzer think? in combination with the half track is actually very strong. Um, the howitzer just to melt and gin blobs and the half track just for some really okay, quick. Okay, something I've noticed I think we need to let the devs know is that the half track, if you click on the tag one half track, it doesn't show how much damage it does against the unit. Uh, true, it's yeah, we, we, we're still them. fixing it, they're still fixing it. Like, it's not totally complete yet. That goes that MG Nest is base is defenseless. Yeah, it's pretty much GG I mean, right now. He did put up a good fight, but right after he put down that MG, um, you know. Yeah, <laughs> like the early uh, when he won like that very early engagement with the houses, like well won. It was more a tie, uh, but when they retreated, when the Japanese retreated, um, he should have just utilized that moment to cap some more stuff. Uh, and consolidate his position instead of like sitting in the house not doing anything uh, yeah he should have been thinking a little more about the future a little more long term in, and he let his engineers idle I don't think up yeah, to, that's, until that's... the last five minutes any of Max's units stayed idle they're running here and there from top to bottom yeah he should have used his engineers more effectively Uh, shall we just fast forward? Like plus four. Okay, times four it is. Because I'm not thinking there's gonna be a very big difference in the outcome right now. No, there isn't. Fortunately, it looks like Yankee is a gunner. Keeps calling him Well, he, he could have just started using building some more. Um, he, he should have just gone for tanks so he can like um, if destroy he went buildings. For tanks, so what I assumed he would have gone for tanks. If he went for tanks, he could have actually took a lot of the battlefield back. But, uh, no, yeah, but game uh, over. It's very expensive to go for tanks, like if you don't have a, enough uh, map control. Yeah, and tanks in this game are really expensive compared yeah, to the other mods. Yeah, true, true. Well, the game over is 489 for Max and 97 for Yankee. Lost. Yeah, well, GG, that was I think Yankee could have put game. a little more effort. A little more effort. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, he's but still I think building he, he a panicked. When he put down that MG nest over there to the left, he was panicking that he's gonna flank from the left, although he wasn't. 
they put on that MG nest without thinking, and maybe afterwards you realise that, oh, you know, crap, I put the MG down the wrong way. But then he tried to attempt to push on the right side down for the oil, that didn't go well either, so I think he just panicked. I, th I think he just panicked. Yeah, that might be it, yeah. Uh, well, GG. It was the first game. GG, well played by Max, well played. Uh, yeah, let's see if the second round goes any better for Yankee.